Slither Samplings introduced a new member to their Essentials family. After the acclaimed Choir Essentials, featuring polyphonic true legato for all sections and the amazing sound quality of their flagship choir libraries, now they dropped Percussion Essentials X3. Percussion Essentials Extreme is a surprise box of cinematic, orchestral and ethnic drums, metals and pretty much everything you can hit with a stick that results in a nice sound or rhythm. I'm a simple guy. If you smash something and it sounds awesome, I like it. Does it sound awesome? Let's find out. Percussion Essentials Extreme comes with ensemble drums in different section sizes, but it also spices it up with a thematic approach of creative instrument combinations. This adds a unique flavor to the library. The patch name Urukai, for example, immediately made me want to load it up and find out what's hiding behind it. And the name sounds way cooler than slamming something on an anvil and afterwards there's a little sound like you drop something. I think most of these thematic combinations are taken from their Thunder Extreme and Lightning Extreme libraries. And in the product description of those, you will recognize some of the ones in Percussion Essentials like Camel Safari, Fist Fighter and The Brute. There you can read that the Urukai patch is actually an anvil thrown on top of a pile of more anvils. How metal is that? <laughs> I do wish Stresov would explain what's behind the thematic ensembles in the description or manual of Percussion Essentials itself, instead of having to search for them, for example, in the Thunder Extreme description. Percussion Essentials includes four contact patches. Symbols, gongs and impacts, ensembles, small and miscellaneous and solos. In Symbols, Gongs and Impacts, you will find symbols with crashes and rises of two different symbol sizes, as well as hi-hats and a tam-tam, small metals with tiny and fun high-pitched percussion, and epic metals plus impacts with organic booms and shattering metal hits. The ensembles patch contains tupans, taikos, frame drums and jamba ensembles with many different playing styles, as well as thematic low, high and ethnic ensembles and a variety of roles. I want to emphasize the many different playing styles, because I was awestruck seeing all these options for playing the Jamble Ensemble alone. Center hits, side hits, muted centers, brushes and flams with several pitches and ensemble sizes give me more room to maneuver than I had expected. In small and miscellaneous, there's small orchestral percussion, different shakers and other clicky sounds. And lastly, in solos, you will see the individual versions of your taikos, jambas and frame drums from the ensemble patches and more. I really like the sound of the cajon by the way. And again, for a library called Essentials, there are a lot of different playing techniques.
As the name suggests, Percussion Essentials runs on the Extreme engine. It was new to me, but I quickly felt at home. There are 12 zones you can load instruments into, and they are spreaded and color-coded over the keyboard. The samples are stored in categories. Here you can control three different mic positions and adjust the stereo field of each. These settings are global for all instruments in the 12 zones. These settings are individual for each instrument. You can control the EQ, attack, sustain and release, and a couple of extra options. You can select and disable each of the up to 15 round robins, and here you can fine adjust the mic positions and panning for each instrument. This slider helps minimize the natural delay of the decca and hall mics compared to the close mic for more tightness. Lastly, you can save and load your zone setups and reset the round robins, which is also linked to a key switch. To me, Stratos sampling has always excelled with organic and natural sounds. I believe this is what makes them so famous for their choir libraries, and I can notice it again here. Playing the patches feels like someone is really slapping and banging on these drums, and this feeling makes percussion essentials also incredibly fun to use. The close mics capture a lot of detail, and dialing in the decca and hall mics helps increase the grandness of your grooves. I created three short demos to give you a taste of Percussion Essentials Extreme's sound palette. The first groove features a taiko ensemble with emphasis on the hall mic. The second one has close mic jambers with their nice and detailed center and side hits as well as mutes for a very organic and realistic sound. Lastly, I have some of the orchestral percussion with a gorgeously dynamic hi hat, a tam tam, and a snare ensemble. I feel like with Percussion Essentials Extreme, Stress of Sampling delivers two things. One is mandatory for a library with such a name, and one is a bonus. Let's talk about the mandatory. There are ensembles and soloists for all kinds of orchestral, cinematic and ethnic drums, like djembes, tupans and taikos, in different sizes, as well as metals, gongs, cymbals and shakers. You can immediately hear that they are brilliantly sampled, and it's pure joy to play with these instruments. It's packed with a surprising amount of content, and personally, I don't have a comparable percussion library yet that gives me so many different playing techniques for these ensemble and solo drums. Again, despite being called essentials. What makes this library extra valuable for me on my composer journey is the selection of thematic combinations. They're great atmospheric appetizers, add a unique touch to my percussion lines, and most of all, they make me hungry for more. I think this is a great achievement, and for now, with no doubt, Percussion Essentials Extreme will be my first choice for organic 
and lively samples. I am super impressed with this. And just as with Coil Essentials, this thing gets a clear recommendation for me. If I could improve something on this library, I would probably add timpanies and make the descriptions for the thematic combinations more easily accessible. Percussion Essentials Extreme is available now on the Stresor Samplings website for an intro price of 149 euros with a regular price of 249. I hope this experience report was helpful to you and I'll see you soon.